Cards with a K is a game of light strategy which pits the powers of World War II, deck versus deck, card versus card, and we're going to take a look at it here today on Legendary Tactics. The Americans. They are a powerhouse faction. Uh, they're going to go up against the Japanese today uh, in this uh, quick tutorial. This is the last part of the tutorial before you would go on to uh, play against uh, other real life players and uh, and build your own decks and so forth. So this is the last of the starter decks that uh, are covered by the tutorial. And uh, I, I like the way they've set this up because you really get a sense, you get a chance to try out each of the factions. And the Americans, uh, you know, they've got great units. Um, they have great economy uh, and uh, they're a force to be reckoned with. And I like this, there's, there's a unit there that I can get down right away. Um, and a 2-2 a, a two -two at a cost of one, that's not too bad, I'll take it. Um, and uh, the Japanese get a 3-1 force down. Nothing special about them though. And uh, unfortunately, I'm kind of priced out of uh, cards at the moment. Um, I can certainly, uh, but I'm, I don't want to advance. I'm gonna hold those guys back just, uh, just in case. Uh, we got some tanks down there. And uh, yeah, so it's... Uh, 2-2 two, two, uh, cost 2 and there's some interesting uh, things where HQs get uh, damaged um, by the uh, by the Japanese forces indirectly which is kind of an interesting uh, thing. It's too bad the tutorial doesn't uh, give you an opportunity to, to try out the Japanese here um, but I'm sure we'll cover them in a future video anyway. Um, so this is uh, perfect they're charging the uh, uh, the, uh, the front line so we're gonna need to uh, to do something here. Um, now I like the uh, now the, they they played uh, the cards of the with that tank down and they actually damaged their own HQ, which is kind of interesting. So uh, anyway, I'm going to uh, look to get my artillery, uh, uh, you know, going for the for the U.S. Uh, artillery in this game can be absolutely devastating. Oh, there's that ec economic card there. That's great. Um, but, uh, you know, artillery can be really, you can really start pummeling the uh, enemy's forces on the, uh, on the front, front line. And he took out, luckily he left my artillery alone, but on the support line you can really do a lot of damage. Um, and uh, they're not even, you know, within range as long as, so you can watch this, they, they take no damage in return and just essentially get a free shot on them uh, there. So that gives a... Nice boost to the economy. We've got, uh, um, hopefully we pick up some other strong cards and can start dropping some uh, some major ones. He's got some planes down. He's getting some, some forces up. Um, in this particular game, I didn't get a, a real, really good sense of, uh, of, the, uh, of the Japanese uh, faction. I'm going to take out their planes. A lot of times I was destroying their units here, as you can see. Uh, so we never really got to interact all that much, but I'm sure they're a good faction in their own way and they're, they're going to have their own style. So, um, but I'm going to, uh, look to get some, uh, basically some support down to protect my, uh, artillery because, uh, I can do four damage on, you know, every turn, um, with, uh, the artillery, even with the units in the, in the support line. See that plane, um, is going to be... An easy victim here that's an obvious target uh, and uh, just checking out the uh, you know the uh, um, the card I picked up just to make sure I wasn't missing out on anything but that planes down that units down um, that's uh, that's a lot of uh, of a momentum shift to just get another artillery down now the only challenge is that they do clog up the support line which is a problem so anyway I had the uh, the extra credits and nothing else better to do so I uh, I narrowed down their force to one card and then I hit them for a uh, card that does random damage well it's pretty straightforward um, <laughs> as far as that goes um, pretty straightforward uh, which card they were gonna hit so um, okay so they are beginning to advance and that's a, a decent uh, decent card so let's see uh, what, what else we get we're gonna Use the Awoken uh, uh, Giant to do some damage in the front line. Again, 
number one, this is the tutorial. Number two, um, it's a, a situation where I've got it well in hand. As you can see, it's just uh, the artillery. I've got uh, pounding the, uh, the enemy HQ. Got lots of credits banked, lots of units in the support line. Um, yeah, this is, uh, this is gonna start swinging my way very soon. Um, even though he has a lot of cards in hand and so forth, uh, he's not place, placing anything down, so he must have actions that are essentially not of benefit. So I'm just gonna basically spend all my credits uh, on, the, uh, on the attack, and, and uh, this game is looking like it's gonna be over, but <laughs> it's a pretty quick, uh, pretty quick um, uh, example of play here. But hope you get a sense. I mean, the Americans, I think, are, are really, really... Uh, powerful like once their economy gets going um, and the cards they have I think are are solid um, especially now that I boosted my artillery and he wasn't able to respond at all so um, just for fun I'm gonna boost up uh, this unit here just to make it uh, unquestionable and I'm gonna take him out with one land unit and one artillery and we'll celebrate the quick victory so that uh, gets us through the uh, tutorial uh, here with cards and I hope this gave you a good idea of, of how the game is played um, once again if you're familiar with Hearthstone uh, which is kind of the fantasy version of, of something like this I think you'll find that this game is is you know very is very close in feel to that but that's not a bad thing Hearthstone is a big following and I think this one has uh, uh, an addictive uh, quality to it so uh, but I hope this, uh, again, just illustrated things for you, and, uh, and it is a free download. Uh, at, least the, uh, at least that's where they start you. Always got to be careful about the, uh, the upgrades and, and uh, the, the buying uh, packs and all that stuff that comes with it. But anyway, thanks so much for watching, and uh, uh, tune in next time here on Legendary Tactics. Take care.